there's one issue that's been on the mind of a lot of political pundits, a lot of observers, anyone who's interested in European issues in a broader sense. And that question is, is a philosophical one. What is the future of the European Union? Is it really going to remain a relevant governmental, regulatory and policy driver in the future? Or is there really a risk that the European Union might fall apart? And I think it's vastly exaggerated to think that the European Union as such would fall apart. The big question is, what powers will remain on a European, or dare I say, federal level, and which are the issues and politi or policies that are going to be renationalized, where member states, the currently 28 member states, will have more powers to actually decide on those issues. Because there's a growing skepticism whether more integration is the way, or certain member states, are, or the member states at large, are to be given certain powers. And this is the dynamic that, that's really going to determine the next years or even decades. The, the constant struggle whether immigration or asylum, should it be really decided on a European level, should it be more nationalized? Or issues related to the foreign policy, is it going to really, is there going to, going to be a European foreign policy or not? But when it comes to the business facing issues, the things which, which regulate environmental standards or noise emissions, all the way to uh, spectrum allocation for, for various uh, technological devices. So all the classic or business facing regulatory side of the European Union is there to stay. That's not going to change and it's going to be just as relevant as ever, if not more.